Hello, I didn't know you're into glamping. <laughs> I know, how good am I doing it? <laughs> really good, In what style. brings you to um, Bundaberg? I'm up here, up here with Dale and uh, with Tackle Vans yeah, and we're right. just enjoying this camping expo and uh, also running a couple of clinics for the kids. Oh wow, what sort of clinics? Nipper clinics. Oh, so, uh, you know, really just enjoying it. I'm going to take them all down the beach and, and just run through just a series of, I guess, drills and exercises and, and try and really get them uh, water aware and, and so they're confident to a certain level. Yeah. How long did it take you to become water aware? I know that you're an Ironman and Olympian. Yeah, uh, I was really lucky. I, I guess I was blessed. My whole family had, has always been involved with surfing in some way and uh, surf life saving. And, and I started surfing when I was two years old, so I've wow. always been in the water. Mum taught me how to swim, which I was really lucky. So, uh, yeah, I, I guess it's, uh, you know, I, I've got salt water running through my veins, you could say. <laughs> oh, that's really nice that you're um, passing on your gifts to the little ones. Um, so, tell me about your Coromel camper van here. This is the Navigator, right? Correct. Wow, I didn't realise you are into glamping. Yeah, look, it's, it's really nice. For me to be able to get away from the coast, I, I think is important, and, and to be able to take the family, I, I think it, uh, it caters for everything that I need at the end of the day, and it's really practical and simple. Absolutely, and to do so in style as well. Do you mind if I come and have a look? I'd love you to come inside. Well, tell me about nippers. What is nippers for people that might not be involved? Yeah, look, nippers, and I guess I'm really lucky to be up here in Bundaberg, is that um, you know, all the kids will come along, and I'll, I'll run them through everything. So running drills, uh, wading drills, um, you know, a little bit of swimming in and out stuff in, into the ocean um, and just some really minor skills I guess at the end of the day and a little bit of paddle boarding so awesome. you know all these kids have got coaches and uh, you know I, I certainly don't want to tell them anything different to what the coaches do but um, you know it, the nipper movement I, I think through surf life saving is a really important one um, it's quite a social event for them it's great for the parents and it's great for the kids as well absolutely and look the caravanning lifestyle is really perfect for people that might want to go away on a surf uh, trip to the coast and yeah. keep their surfboards and you know just go away once a year or yeah a couple of times yeah a year. absolutely and and i've been thinking of putting some racks actually on on my um, my pop-up so um awesome. you know so i can get my boards on the roof it would just make it really simple at the moment i can i can fit them just in here down the middle and uh it makes it really simple but uh you know, I, I just enjoy it. There's, there's plenty of space for us, and uh, you know, I can do all my cooking here. I've got my fridge, and uh, you know, it, it's just it's really handy. What's your involvement with Coromel? I know it's a brand that's pretty close to your heart. Yeah, look, I, I think the the similarities between myself and, and Coromel are, um, are there. The, the connection, I, I think, at the end of the day, it's very Australian and Australian owned, and uh, you know, I'm I'm very Australian myself, and uh, I think you know what. What I love about it is, is just the opportunity to be able to go away because I do so much through, through the year as far as racing and competing. It's very rare for me to get downtime. So to be able to throw this on the back of the car and, and go away for a couple of nights is just so handy and, and I, I love that. Uh, you know, to be able to think that I can do that when, you know, at a drop of a hat. Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. And what sort of advice would you give to the young nippers out there that might want to follow in your footsteps? Oh, look, you know, it's so simple. Just enjoy what you do. I, I think we're so lucky to have the beaches and the coastline that we have here in Australia. You know, we, we live in the best place in the world. I, I really, honestly, I've seen so much of the world. And to say that, you know, I can call Australia home, you know, I'm, we're so lucky to have this place. And, uh, you know, at a drop of a hat, I can put put the navigator on the back of the car and just go away and, and just, just, just lose myself. <laughs> totally. And, um, you know, that, that's what I love about it. And, uh, you know, any advice for the kids is just to, to really just enjoy love, uh, yeah. joy, joy life and enjoy, enjoy the ocean. I, I think it's a great place and we're very blessed to have the beaches we do. Awesome, Kai. Thank you so much for no the chat. No worries. Thank it's been you. a pleasure. And for anybody that wants to find out about the Nippers Clinic that Kai Hurst will be running in Bundaberg, you can jump on the Coromel website, which is coromel.com.au, or you can just look at the dates as they magically appear here. <laughs> Don't you love how I can do that? Oh, high five. That's too good. <laughs> What's up down under?